Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I am here again with another Dollar Tree haul. These are my favorite kind of hauls. I visit the Dollar Tree often, and I'm always excited about what I get. I always spend a good amount there. Um, a lot of the stuff that I get, again, is uh, repurchases, um, things to just kind of save and have, and other things are just new things that I've seen there. So let's go ahead and get started. So first of all, I have this, um, compact eyelash curler and I've seen this there before and I just never picked it up because I'm not really the kind to like get ready on the go um, but I figured if I ever need it or whatever it's compact so I can just stick it in my purse and we're gonna just have to see how this works because I've never tried this before it's by the brand sassy and chic that is one of them they only had black but I think I've seen other colors before in the past so I picked up one of those. I picked up this sugar lip scrub from LA Colors. I love lip scrubs. I have a few of them. Um, some of them are high end, some of them are drugstore. And I feel like a lip scrub is a lip scrub. Like it's gonna do what it's gonna do. And I've even made my own lip scrubs and I don't use it very often. Um, but when I do use it, I love it because it's exfoliating my lips and it feels really good and really soft. They had a few LA Color things there. I didn't pick up everything, but this, I definitely wanted to try it out. So a couple things that I got for my daughter is this LA Colors, um, it says it's a lip balm, um, but it kind of looks like it's a color. So I don't know if it's like maybe a tinted lip balm, but it's LA Colors Lip Balm uh, Gelato. It's a new item and it looks like a little, ice cream scoop like the scoop that goes on top of your ice cream cone and I thought that was really cool they had chocolate they had mint and they had vanilla and I think they had another one but I picked up vanilla because I know that she loves vanilla scented everything so I got her that and I also got her this lip smacker lip um, balm as well. She really likes these um, lip balms. She doesn't, she's not really into the whole princess theme stuff anymore, um, but she really likes Olaf because he's a snowman. I have this new scent from the April showers, April bath and shower um, collection. They have this cranberry, um, this is a body spray. They also have the lotion, um, the gel, the body gel, and the hand lotion, like a body lotion and hand lotion. Um, but they have this one and then they have like a cinnamon spice um, scent as well. But I didn't really care for the other one, so I went ahead and picked up this one. Um, this is, I, I don't really use it as a body spray. Sometimes I'll like use it as a room spray um, because they're really cheap. I figure like I'm just going to use it as a room spray. But if my daughter wants this and she wants to use it, I'm going to go ahead and let her have it. I found this limited edition Yardly. Uh, bar soap. This was the last one there and it's the Yardley London limited edition pumpkin cream and cinnamon with amorous oil. I think I'm saying that right. Maybe not. Anyway, this is really giving me like fall vibes, um, Thanksgiving vibes. So come Thanksgiving time, I'm probably going to set this out in my bathroom. Oh my God. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, this is gonna be perfect for like a guest bathroom or anything, anything like, so cute. Um, and it was a limited edition, so I was like, I have to get it. Anything limited edition, like, I have to get it. I got this dial, and honestly, I only got it because it said lavender on it. I love anything lavender. So this is two um, bars, this antibacterial, it's lavender and Twilight Jasmine. It's um, clean, rinsing, non-drying. Non so definitely it's good to have a non-drying soap because you just don't want dry skin after you use it. Obviously you wear lotion and stuff afterwards, but you still you wanna make sure that it's moisturizing your hands, your body, whatever you use it for, your face. Um, okay, so moving along, I went ahead and picked these up. Now, I have never used Dollar Tree razors before. And this is a brand that I've never heard of. They had the other brands, like actual name brands, um, but they were like a one blade 
and I just can't do that. Like I have really thick hair, so I can't do that. But this is a six blade and it looks kind of like the Bic. I use the guy's razor Bic. So I don't know, I figured I'd try one, give one to my daughter um, or just give them both to her. But it looks, I've seen reviews on this and they say it works. So I'm gonna give it a shot. So yeah, two in one for, for one dollar. And then right next to it, I saw these and I'm like, oh, well you get three for a dollar. And this only has one less blade. So five blade, lubricating strip. So that's really important. Although I do use shave gel, shave um, cream and stuff like that to shave, but you never know. You don't want nicks and cuts. Um, but anyway, I got that. Along with that, I saw this shave gel there. And last time I picked up the um, imitation brand for EOS and they actually work really well. I've been using it. I'm almost out of one bottle and it works really well. I do pack it on, so that's why I'm almost out. But anyway, I wanted to try this one because that one is a shave cream and this is a shave gel. I don't exactly know the difference, but I wanted to try it. It says it's moisturizing. It's got vitamin E and aloe vera and it's in the uh, scent Berry Burst. I picked these up for my husband. This is the Arm & Hammer brand. They do, they started carrying these at my dollar, dollar store about a year ago, I think I noticed them, and it always comes with the bonus trial size. So this is the three-in-one um, body wash, shampoo, and conditioner. Yes, my husband is the kind that just uses one thing for everything. So this is perfect for him. It's a dollar, it's a big size, why not, you know? And it's a good trustworthy brand, in my opinion. And then I also got this one, which they also have there. And this is just the body wash. Um, I picked up these two, Arm & Hammer. Can't go wrong with Arm & Hammer. And I'm so excited that Dollar Tree has them because sometimes it's like crazy expensive, especially for men. Sometimes men's care things are more expensive than women's. And I'm like, get out of here. The next thing I got were these. I found this new. Like, they have these there, but this is new. Bath, bath soak, bath salts. Um, this is by Spa Natural Naturals Luxury Collection, and it's an avocado oil one. Like, they have the regular Epsom salt one. They have the lavender one. They even have, like, a, a charcoal one. But I have never seen an avocado oil one, and I love anything that has avocado oil, castor oil, grapeseed oil, olive oil, anything, all those oils. So I picked one up and I am excited to try this whenever I give myself a bath next. So it's calming and relaxing, it nourishes the skin, and it leaves it smooth, soft, and supple. And it has a wonderful, refreshing scent. So I found these two hand sanitizers, foaming hand sanitizers. And first I saw this one, I saw cranberry and I was like, hello, cranberry, yes. I love anything cranberry. Um, and then I kept moving on down the aisle and I saw this mint lemon. And I was like, that is so cute. Like my kids are gonna love it. These are perfect. I mean, just pump and go. You don't get too much. You're not making a mess, dripping it all over the floor, all over your clothes, etc. So I figured these two are great and they're pretty good size. I found these other bath salts and I thought this container container was really cute. Sometimes I'm sold on the packaging <laughs> and I really like this container, but I also like the bath salts because they are watermelon, watermelon and aloe and they're by, by the Bolero brand. I cannot talk today. They're by the Bolero brand and I just thought it was cute little packaging I probably use this whole thing in my tub, I'm not gonna lie, I use a lot of bath salts. Um, if not, halfway anyway, or more than halfway. Um, so excited for these, love my bath times, and I love my bath salts, <laughs> witch hazel. Now, this is a really small container. I remember Dollar Tree used to carry like the bigger ones of witch hazel in like the brown bottle or was it a white bottle but it was bigger than this i do remember it was bigger than this like this is about the size of my hand and but nonetheless i found it and i really like witch hazel like i'll use it as a toner sometimes like there's so many good uses for it i found these 
Airwick. I like them because they're Airwick. They're actually the name brand. Um, they're called Stick Ups Air Fresheners. So you put them, you stick them in your, um, it can go in your closet, under your trash can, on the lid of your trash can, um, even in your car. That's kind of neat. So it's uh, odor neutralizer. And I, I honestly, I got this to put it in my bathroom because my bathroom is really small. And right now we only have one bathroom where we're living now. I'm going to stick this in my bathroom. It's really small and hope it works. But I got the, um, I guess the original. And then I got the sparkling citrus. Oh no, this is crisp breeze. And then this one is sparkling citrus. So there's two in each, so I got four, and I'll let you know how those work. I want to do like a review of things, or like a what to buy, what not to buy at the Dollar Tree, so that video is coming up soon. So I got this, this is new to my Dollar Tree, I have not seen it there. Um, it is a natural eyelash enhanced serum with castor oil, and it's got a brush applicator. So I've seen these Beauty Guru things. I buy the Beauty Guru essential oils, um, the lavender, the tea tree, and the stress relief. So the Beauty Guru um, essential oils, and I have all of them. I think it's only got two ingredients. Yeah, it's only got two ingredients. It's got castor oil and rosemary. And the castor oil is for the hair follicle, and the rosemary is for nourishing it. So that is pretty cool. Like if this works, Oh my goodness, I, that's gonna be, I'm gonna go back to that store and buy everything. So buy all the ones that they have. So it looks like this, um, it's quite thick. Castor oil is thick, so that doesn't surprise me. Um, it doesn't really smell like anything, but anyway, I guess you, and it comes with a little spoolie, so you dip it in there and then you put it on your eyelashes. So I'm definitely gonna try that and I will check back with you guys in about a month, maybe, um, and see if it if it's worked. Um, my eyelashes are not super long, but they're not short either. I'm always trying to grow my eyelashes. I mean, who isn't, right? And I did get two of them. I got two of them because I was like, what if I really like it and I come back and they're gone? So I got two, gonna test it out. And then this is also new by Beauty Guru and it is the uh, Natural Clear Skin Serum. And this has got tea tree. I'm excited about these things. Like, if this actually works from the Dollar Tree, like this is gonna be a breakthrough. <laughs> anyway your skin. I think this you just, unless it's got a dropper, I don't think so, but I think this one you just kind of dab it on your skin. Yeah, you just kind of dab it on your skin. The other ones come with a dropper, like the lavender and the stress relief um, come with a drop, dropper. They also have a rollerball one, so Dollar Tree is not playing around. They're not playing around. Okay, so the next thing I love getting this from the Dollar Tree. Let me just tell you, okay? Toothpaste. I love getting my toothpaste from the Dollar Tree because it's a dollar. And I mean, they have so many varieties. It's literally this big. But I'm the only one that uses this. So my husband and my kids have their own. So I also got the ultra white with charcoal because I wanted to give this a try. I keep hearing about how charcoal is really good for whitening, but I've also heard horror stories about charcoal, so I'm playing it safe. But I got this one and then I got this one because this is the one I used to use a long time ago. So, and I'm trying to whiten my teeth as much as I can. So I figured, why not try these? They're a dollar, you get a variety. And this is a stain eraser in the, in the fresh mint flavor. I found this small little tea tree. It was just kind of hanging out. It was like none, none other. Like there was nobody else in this little guy's category around him. It was just, he was just hanging out right there. Like he was just meant to come home with me. But it is just tea tree oil. 
and oh, I love this small tea tree. Um, now, I'm gonna have to read this through. Oh yeah, okay, so it is for skin because the other essential oils that you pour into your wax melt um, are not for your skin. But this is, it says, ideal for blemished skin. And I have a lot of blemishes in my skin, so I'm gonna give that a try. The next thing I got was this, and this is for my husband. This is a softie, he's a beard kind of guy. So he's got a beard and he's growing it and he's trying to take care of it. So beard hair, as we all know, is a lot thicker than hair head, hair head, head hair, hair on your head. Um, but he says that he likes this because it leaves it really soft and really shiny. So it's a really small little tube and it's the only one I could find there. Again, all by his lonesome, just hanging out, waiting for little old me to come pick it up. But yeah, next I got these cotton rounds because we always need cotton rounds. I mean, I use this for my toner. I use this to take off my eyelash, um, mas my mascara, nail polish, you name it. Anyway, always, always have to have these. I found these little spray bottles and the other day I needed one and now I cannot even remember what for, but I didn't have one. And so I was like, when I go to the Dollar Tree, I'm gonna get one. And last time I forgot, but this time I saw it there and I went ahead and picked it up. So it's just two little small bottles. They're really small. I'm sure they have bigger sizes, but this is all that I could find. So I just picked them up and Oh, they're actually from the Crafter Square uh, pump spray bottles. So you can really put anything in here, like anything in here. So you never know what you may need them for and they're just a dollar, so why not? That's what I always say. Anyway, I got these two, um, these are hair masks. They do have lotions and this is the Bolero brand. They do have lotions that kind of come like this, like body butter. Um, I really don't like the lotions from the Dollar Tree. They're very watered down and they're not moisturizing. Just my opinion. This is the Bolero Ad Avocado Oil and Honey. Uh, forget Frizz, forget Frizz, forget Frizz hair mask. Um, avocado and honey. And then I got the Almond Milk and Agave Super Strengthening Hair Mask. Okay, the next thing I got is this Deep Conditioning Nope, it's not a mask. It's just a deep conditioning, deep conditioner. Um, coconut oil and vitamin E. And you put it in your hair, you leave it in for three minutes and then you rinse it. So you can do it in the shower. You can do it before you shower. It's coconut. I love anything coconut. I love, oh, I love the smell of coconut. Like, it just gives me life. It gives me life. Okay, next I found this um, tacky glue. I needed this for one of my son's projects like earlier this week, like a few days ago, and I could, I didn't have any. So I tried to use some other kind of glue and it ended up a disaster. When I saw this today, I was like, I have to get this. I have to take this home with me because I'm a mom. I have kids. I have little ones. I have kids that do projects and they need this kind of stuff. And Dollar Tree, hooks you up, okay? They hook you up. I got a bunch of toothbrushes. So I got this toothbrush. This is the one I'm currently using. I just got a, a second one. Um, and this is charcoal infused. I like it because it's soft. I like the soft bristles. Um, I don't like the medium and I don't like the hard. I got this for my six year old. Um, they had like a pink and a blue one, but they're both gonna be for him, so I figured. I'll just get him this yellow and green. So I got him that one. He still has his baby teeth, so he still falls under baby toothbrush category for me. I got this for my older son and my older daughter, um, the two oldest, and they don't have baby teeth anymore. Well, maybe some, but mostly they got their adult teeth. Um, so I picked this up, him a green one and a pink one for her, um, for when we switch out our toothbrushes. And then I got this one for myself and my husband for later on. I just like to have backups. I like to have extras. Um, so I'm not like feeling like I need to go run to the store and get something when I need it. So uh, blue for my husband, pink for myself. And this is by the Quackers brand. And then I got this one for my husband for right now because we are both due for new toothbrushes. 
Um, so I just got this one, pretty simple, nothing, nothing crazy. Let me tell you guys something. If you guys have little ones in sippy cups, Dollar Tree sippy cups will hook you up, okay? But they have Big Bird, um, Cookie Monster, and Elmo. And this is the second set or third set that I've bought him from the Dollar Tree because they are so cheap and so good. Like, they're um, spill proof. They're BPA free. Um, what else does it say? Eight ounce, six months and up. And it's just perfect. I mean, really, all my son really likes to drink is water. Like, I've, I give him milk, juice, well, that's about it. But he prefers his water. So I just give him one of these and he likes them. Like, and you can teach him like colors, blue, um, yellow, red. Like he's starting to learn his colors because every time I give him his cup, I'm like, your blue cup, you know, and I like talk to him and stuff. And he's about to be two, so he's a lot older now. But yeah, I started using those for ever since he first started sippy cups. There is no need to go and spend a fortune at Target um, for sippy cups that are really later just gonna be everywhere. Well, I should speak for my kids because my kids just kind of leave everything everywhere. They go outside and they leave them outside. And yeah, so anyway, I love the Dollar Tree. They also have these clear ones that are, they're slightly bigger. They're not a, any kind of brand. They didn't have any today, so I just picked these up. But yeah, that's the one I use for my little kiddo because I've bought him the expensive ones and it's just like not even worth it and they, they're not as good as these. I bought ones with a straw from Target and it leaks, like the, the straw will leak out and I'm like really? I paid like seven bucks for this one and it's like crazy. I found these little, um, what are they, they're called cover ups variety pack so if you don't have a lid to a container and you want to put something in the fridge you just put this over it. And let me see if I can show you guys. My mom used to have these when I was younger. And I just thought they were so cool because like sometimes I couldn't find the lid to something. And I would just go and grab one of these and they literally just go over your dish. And you can, they're covered. And you can stick it in your fridge, put it away, whatever, wherever you're gonna put it. But there are different sizes. So you get four smalls, you get seven mediums, and six larges. So that's pretty cool because a lot of my containers are missing their lids. So, yeah, and that's said. <laughs> so next I found these three, they had different colors, but just gray neutral kind of calls out to me more. I love how easy they are to wash, to clean, to use. They don't stick, they don't burn. Yeah, I got this lemon squeezer. I don't know what it's called, citrus squeezer. Um, they had a green one and they had a yellow one. I got the yellow one because I love lemons more than limes, which doesn't matter, but um, I got this one and yeah, so you just put your half of your lemon in there and then you squeeze it. My mom used to have one when I was little, but it was like made of like metal or something. So I figured that can come in handy because I drink lemon water all the time and I hate squeezing it from my hands. <laughs> I got these scissors. These scissors, oh my God, they are a lifesaver in your house, like in my house. I keep them in my kitchen. I have one in my kitchen, crafts, kids, everywhere. Like these are good. Um, you can use them to cut food. I use them to cut my son's food sometimes. Cut um, strings off of things, anything. Anything kitchen or not kitchen, whatever you decide to use them in. I got this little handheld um, what is it? Colander? Colander. Am I saying that right? Um, handheld because I have a slightly bigger one than this and then I have an even bigger one than this one. So I'm like, what if I just want to quickly strain something and then pour it back in the thing? So, yeah. Are these? Reynolds, Reynolds Wrap Foil Sheets. Um, I really learned to love these things because the other one that you have to pull out and cut just frustrates me so much. This one, they're pre-cut. You take a piece and you just fold up whatever you're gonna fold up in there and you're done, good to go, one piece. And if one is too big, you can just cut that one in half and you're good to go. So, I'm almost done. 
I got these scrunchies because I thought they were so cute. Like, look at how cute that is. They have the little pineapple um, keychain thing. I think that's super cute. And they had this color, this color, and like a green color, but I didn't get the green color. I didn't really like it, but they're super cute. I might give them to my daughter. I might keep them. I might just give her one. I don't know. But if anything, they're just cute for decoration. There I go again with my packaging. Um, and then I got these scrunchies and these are just black regular scrunchies. I've grown to love, this is from the Dollar Tree. I've grown to love these scrunchies because they don't pull and tug at my hair. They're comfortable and I could just wear them around my wrist if I'm not wearing them and when I need them and they're not like tight, really tight on my wrist. So yeah, I got three of those. So you get three for a dollar. And they had so many more, like different colors, different styles. But for me, I mean black. Black goes with everything. So I got two of these little uh, Lysol. They're super tiny. Um, I know, but I needed some. I'm completely out. I needed some, and I'm not going to go to Sam's for another while. So, and I was at the Dollar Tree, and I clean my bathroom very often because, like I said, we only have one bathroom, and we're a family of six, so we use it a lot. So I am in the habit of cleaning my bathroom almost daily, um, every two days, if not daily. So I ran out of this, and I don't like the Dollar Tree brand or the one that says the works or something like that. That's like, I feel like it's just water. So these are going to have to hold me off until I go get a bigger one at Target or Walmart. Um, and this is the Lysol uh, Clean and Fresh. And this is the Power Total Cleaner. So nothing exciting about those, but they get the work done. All right, next I got cleaning vinegar. And this, I mean, I don't really need to explain much about this, just cleaning vinegar. I like to put it in my laundry whenever I wash my towels. It makes them fluffier and it also takes the smell away from um, wet towel smell. So the next thing is this fabric air freshener. Fabric freshener. It is also by LA Totally Awesome, LA's totally awesome and it's a new item sorry so it's a freshener it's pretty big it's a pretty big one um, I smelled it at the store and it does smell actually really good and honestly I just yeah it smells like like oh what's fabric softener yeah fabric softener that you put in your clothes like it literally smells like that's so good um, I spray this on like my couches, on my curtains, on my um, bed sometimes, just wherever I feel like I need to freshen up but not actually wash because it's not time for it to be washed. Um, or like your couches, I don't have a uh, water vacuum, like one of those ones that you use on your carpets. I don't have one, so until I get one. I'm just kind of using that and other techniques. But I also got this disinfectant spray. Um, it says it kills 99.9% .9 of germs. Um, it's in the scent linen and it kills the flu virus, eliminates odors. So I do have, we do have a dog. So having a dog, you're always gonna have like that smell in your house. And I'm not about that. So I always try to keep the house smelling good, smelling clean, smelling fresh. And so I spray this in the air, I spray this on the doorknobs, I spray this everywhere. And normally, I've never tried this, but normally, it does smell good. Normally, I'll buy them at like um, Sam's in bulk. Again, I'm not gonna be going to Sam's for a while, so I needed something to hold me off until then. This should do, ouch, just bang my head. Okay. Last but not least, Brillo pads. These come in handy every single time in my kitchen. Like they are not just good for pots and pans, they are good to clean your surface, like your, not all your surfaces, but your glass stove, if you have a glass stove, um, even your microwave, like I use these things for everything. And then I also got these Scrub Buddies soap pads. Um, it says to compare the SOS soap pads. 
So this one, um, this one you get 10, and on this one you get eight, but just nothing can compare to these. So I just went ahead and got these because they have a little bit more and I wanted to try them. But yeah, that is it. That is my Dollar Tree haul. That's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you guys later.